So, uh, what's new in Mortal Kombat 10? Uh, well, you know, the official name is actually Mortal Kombat X. Oh, yes. Uh, but, yeah, know, Mortal Kombat X, done. X, X stands for, you know, it's Roman numeral 10. It's the next kind of like next generation, you know, consoles. We have next generation characters. Um, and uh, we have a whole new, a uh, couple of new fighting features that we'd like to kind of demonstrate for you here as well. So there's there's a number of new uh, characters that we're revealing here. Actually, right. four, four, ones just just for uh, E3 here. Awesome. Which is, and I think this game is probably going to introduce the most uh, number of new characters than any Mortal Kombat game has. All right, I'm waiting. Here we go. So who do we have over here? Right here, that's uh, Ferator, which is a uh, kind of big hulking creature with a little lady who's on his back. He takes. Uh, commands from and uses her in the in combat and of course sub zero which uh, most people got recognized uh, so you're gonna see some really cool combos with uh with ferator where he actually uses the uh the uh the little lady as part of the part of the combos so it's, uh, it's now, a cool uh, throws and stuff that he has now they count as one or two characters because that's like a combo just one, just just one, one character but they work in tandem with each other which is really cool and you notice that Sub Zero was kind of like swinging on that tree branch. So that's one of the features, new features we have. It's kind of we're calling background leveraging, where basically you can kind of propel yourself in certain off certain parts of the background, kind of gaining a uh, momentum. Yeah, I saw one of the stages during the trailer where it was like there were like waves coming by and like bodies coming up, and you take the body, and that was like pretty epic. Yeah, exactly. And so you just saw that uh, uh, Sub Zero jumped off that tree there, and he's kind of cornered in the. In the on the side here and he takes oh, that branch oh. and kind of smashes him with it. Oh. So it's like all these opportunities to, you know, kind of move yourself about the background or, you know, have a grab a quick weapon. You see uh, uh, Ferrator here getting his uh, entrails, oh. entrails frozen and then jammed into his eye here. Oh, so what triggers these close-ups? Like, when do we see that? Those are the, the x-ray moves, which is something that we introduced in, in uh, Mortal Kombat 9, which was an MK in uh, 2011. And uh, that was something that people really loved. They embraced. Uh, we had these Super meters, a really great uh, number of moves can be performed with them. So we kept that and right. added uh, these variations of characters on. Awesome. So, what other, um, who's gotten like the most treatment of the original characters? Who's gotten the most love, you'd say? Well, the only returning ones that. Oh. And uh, I think Scorpion's probably gotten the most love. It's probably a little bit too much. We gotta let Sub Zero win some of those fights. Uh -huh. that we're here. There we go. I'm sure you'd appreciate that. So cool. What else? What are you most proud of so far in Mortal Kombat X? You know, uh, one of the things we're very excited about is this, you know, this concept of the, the variations of the character. You know, normally when you're uh, playing a fighting game, a character is defined by their, their costume and what they can do. Right. So, you know, with, with, with Mortal Kombat X, every character has three versions of them, three variations of them. So you can pick um, different versions of the characters that have different moves that are exclusive to themselves. So they play like di like they have different abilities. They yeah, exactly. Look. That's awesome. So you know, but Sub Zero will always have his Ice Ball, but this version of Sub Zero can actually summon weapons. So he can like you know bring out this big hammer that he that he that he can use. He can has these, these daggers that he can use in in a, in a combo, which is really uh, Oh, he's stabbing yeah. there, and, and he has a sword that he can bring out, which is awesome. So it's 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 a really, um, but only that version, version of Sub Zero yes. does it. The other two right. have like one has a clone, one has an ice shield. Yep. It really um, makes matchups a lot more of an interesting thing. Right. So you're gonna want to make sure you know all the variations of all the characters who want to be competitive here. Exactly. <laughs> so oh, I love that. <laughs> yeah, he breaks the person. The spine there. So now, can I ask, what goes through, like, what happens when you guys are discussing what fatalities to do? Like, what what is a session like that like when you guys are sitting in a room like, yeah, it'd be cool if you just, like, grab that spine, just snap it in half while it's still inside of them. Everybody sits around a table. You know, some people bring 